Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer software testing interview question 310. That is, what is fault tolerance testing? Let me answer. So what is fault tolerance testing? Fault tolerance testing is nothing but testing a module or functionality of the application towards its breaking point to ensure whether it is working correctly or not. So what exactly is this? Okay, this line is fine, but what exactly is uh, performed as part of the fault tolerance testing? Here guys, as software testers, we generally test or handle the application while testing it in a smooth manner, like a normal user uses the application. But in fault tolerance testing, we will not use the application in a smooth manner. We are going to roughly handling the roughly handle the application guys okay we are going to do a lot of repetitive steps uh, we will we will be very speed at uh, testing the things okay so uh, without giving much gap we'll be closing something opening something uh, doing some random things in a faster manner okay our intention here of doing this uh, rough testing on the application in a repetitive manner or faster manner the only intention is to see whether the application is breaking any functionality of the application is breaking because of our actions is rough actions or repetitive actions which are done in a very frequent and speed manner okay so if the application is able to handle our roughness and still working properly then fault tolerance testing is passed otherwise sometimes what happens is that this happened with us where when uh, where we were doing this fault tolerance testing we are roughly handling the application with the speed and we are doing very repetitive things like adding a lot of records okay if there is a functional like adding a lot of records adding a lot of records and suddenly the application used to crash okay it was like unable to handle our speed or roughness whatever you can call okay a speed at which we are doing or a kind of repeated activity we are doing our the application will crash okay it will not be able to bear at that point and it will break the application may break this may happen but uh, it is not compulsory that it will happen for everyone okay so this kind of testing we generally perform after uh, finding all the defects and a day comes when uh, application looks very stable and you really want to find one more defect even though the application is stable you want to find something out of the some defect or as a software tester right you are always curious to find some defects okay so once this uh, high level defects are completed and uh, the application looks very stable and uh, is working very in a proper way and still if you want to see whether to what extent it can bear okay at that time we do this fault tolerance testing guys in a rough manner we'll handle the application normal cases the normal user will not do that that kind of things but we'll still as software tester we want to do something to break the application and find the defect okay so that is fault tolerance testing uh, so it has also has uh, some other names guys you can also call fault fault tolerance testing as gorilla testing or frustration testing or torture testing also these are the other names for fault tolerance testing so hope guys you understood what is fault tolerance testing in this session so that's all for this session in the next session i'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you till then see you bye bye